Hey guys, I hope you're having a great day today. I wanted to share with you guys something that I saw in an article. It's something that Ripster for Christ posted in his Telegram account. This is also Dustin from Busy for the Lord here on YouTube. And it's regarding the third temple um, being built. And so we know that um, from Bible prophecy that the third temple will have to be in place by the half way point in the tribulation period so three and a half years in because the antichrist will set himself up in the temple to declare himself to be god and so in this article it says that during independence day for israel which was the evening of may 4th into the evening of may 5th um, there were some jews that gathered and began prepping stones for the third temple okay so um Let's see, the headline is Jews begin building third temple on Israel Independence Day. So they're not actually building the temple on the Temple Mount. Uh, right now the Dome of the Rock is there. But um, they are prepping stones for the third temple. And we know that they already have um, the artifacts for the third temple that will be used in the third temple. They are training Levite priests. Um, for that role, they are prepping red heifers. They are raising red heifers that will be used as the purification sacrifice for the dedication of the third temple. And they are ready to go in building this third temple. Um, of course, there are tensions regarding the Temple Mount right now um, in between uh, the Muslims and the Jews. And so, um, you know, we know that they're not ready per se, to go ahead and build um, on that site. But they have everything in place. Um, if you guys are really curious about this, go to templeinstitute.org. Um, it's an actual website that they have in regards to this third temple and preparation for the third temple to be built. So I recommend to you guys to go look it up. It's templeinstitute.org. They even take donations that go towards the building of the third temple so they are really serious about this you guys they want to be able to build that third temple so they can continue with their sacrifices and we know from bible prophecy like i said that temple will be in place during the tribulation period i'm going to read second thessalonians 2 4 to you guys it says and this is speaking about the antichrist who opposes and exalts himself against every so-called God or object of worship so that he takes his seat in the temple of God, proclaiming himself to be God. So it says right there that he's going to take his seat in the temple of God. This is speaking of the third temple. We also know from Daniel 9 that the temple will be rebuilt during a time of trouble. Could that be a reference to Jacob's trouble? I believe so, the tribulation period. And then... We also know in Daniel 9 that the Antichrist will set himself up in the temple as God at three and a half years into the tribulation, which is the halfway point in the tribulation period. And then we know that famous passage of scripture in Matthew 24 where Jesus says, let those, um, let them flee to the mountains, you know, without looking back, basically. And that is whenever the Antichrist sets himself up in the temple, the Jews will have this realization that he is not God, that he is the Antichrist, and Jesus is the real Messiah, and they will flee into the wilderness to a place prepared by God. And so I just think that this article shows that they are pushing even more so um, to build this third temple. And we know from scripture that it will happen. And so this just makes me wonder how much will the church see before the rapture? You know, we may see a lot more, you know, I'm not, I'm not sure. Um, but they are, as Barry Scarborough says, sitting on G and waiting on O. They are ready to go. And so are we, you guys. So um, just a little bit of encouragement. Keep looking up. We know that day is approaching, the day of the rapture, when we will see Jesus and be with him forevermore. So therefore, comfort one another during these troublesome times that we live in. God bless you guys. I hope to see you in the clouds very soon. It is a great day to be raptured.